Hey everybody, welcome aboard. Captain Mike here. Um, I just put this together real quick because I stumbled upon this. Um, I was having nothing but issues with stutters going on with 2020. Um, and this may even work with 2024 as well. Now I'm out at LA. I've got some pretty severe weather going on here. And I'm just going to go ahead and do a little loop-de-loop -loop here. And as you'll be able to see here, hopefully you'll be able to see those flickers. You see those flickers going on there? All right, we'll do a one or two of these. This way, you know it's not just texture being loaded in because now I'm facing that particular direction. So, but as you can see, as I spin around here, um, I'm getting some massive flickers going on. Now, I run seven screens, but there's one big difference that I found here, and that is with my front screen having the, you know, the main front screen that 2020 gives you, 2024 gives you, that has that pull-down menu where you can change the time of day, the clouds, and, you know, all that stuff, get into the toolbar, um, that seems to be the issue. Because what I did was I went ahead and created an eighth view now. I have seven. Three here, four down here running on one computer. I'm going to bring this main screen down that has their pull-down menu on it. I'm just going to minimize it. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring up the additional view that I created for the center that doesn't have that menu on it. So I have a, a 4K that's running that has the menu minimized plus this screen this screen this screen which is four and then four down here now I'm running eight now we're gonna go in the same circle out here at LA and you'll see the difference I think it has something to do with their pull down menu uh, let's swing around here look at this it's like butter and all I did was minimize the screen that has the pull-down menu on it and add another 4K into the mix. Look at that. That's like butter. All the way around. And I can come back to the main menu screen here. That's where you say, oh, well, maybe all the, the scenery is loaded because we've been sitting here a while. That's not the case. Because I can go back into the menu the one that has the menu on it, I'll minimize this one. And I will bring up the one that has the menu on it. This one has the menu on it. And we'll go for another spin. And the flickers are back. All around. So maybe uh, Microsoft may want to go ahead and take a look at that. Um, and if you're experiencing stutters and flickers every now and then, you may want to try this trick. Because it has worked wonders on my setup. And I'm putting a heavy demand on my computer. Well, I'm sure most of you aren't putting that much of a demand on your setup. So, you may want to give this little trick a try. I found this basically by accident. Um, so we're going to take that. I'm going to minimize this bad boy one more time. I'll bring up the new window 3 for the center. And we're off to the races. And we even have aircraft being backed out and they're running pretty smooth. I'm out at LAX. So, if you're having issues, you may want to give this a try. Because this is absolutely amazing. It's like night and day. So. Alright everybody. I just wanted to get this out real quick. Because this was an interesting find. Alright everybody. I'll catch you on my next run. Take care. I'm going to go have dinner. <laughs>